hundreds of hikers set out on a day-long adventure to the summit of Mount Washington. Oh yeah, this is just the start. I'm planning on doing many more hikes, even higher, and you know, maybe Rocky Mountains or you know, places like that. And you know, I definitely gonna come up here every year. Ken Olson is visiting the White Mountains for the first time. The Connecticut resident made it his mission to climb the highest peak in the Northeast, and he's joining hikers from across the nation. I lost a lot of weight, and I'm, you know, get my looking to get myself in tip-top shape, and I figure this is the place to go. <sighs> Seek the peak is more than a physical challenge; it's a charitable one as well. Participants raise a minimum of $200 to help maintain the mountain's world-famous weather station on the summit. Where we do the hourly weather observation on the summit, we provide higher summits forecasts, we provide regional weather data. Since its first event in 2001, the Hikeathon has raised more than $1.6 million for the nonprofit observatory. But hikers say it's not just the chance to give back, luring them to Mount Washington. Carry a heavy pack and enjoy your time with friends out in nature. The, the greatest part of it is when we all gather and it's just this sort of this incredible energy of people that just have had a spectacular weekend in the White Mountains and know that they have this common bond of all like, com coming together to support the observatory. In New Hampshire, Courtney Sturgeon, WMTW News 8.